Hey there, West up here with Dove Development Consulting. So what we've been doing over the last several installments here is we've been talking about a number of different profitability killers that are guaranteed to be impacting your business and how specifically leadership and effective communication can really address it. Now, what we're going to do is close the loop. Most recently, we looked at um, you know, as leaders, are we really taking the time to listen and identify what our folks are looking for so we can even um, have a shot at, at taking care of the things that matter most to our employees, addressing the issues, the concerns, etc. What we're going to do now is look specifically if we're um, at, if we're not, how that perception of bad leadership can kill profitability. And I'm going to make a case for saying, hey, it, it certainly has a ton of cost and we're going to dig into that. But the, the real question is, gosh, it's not a matter of are we necessarily bad or not. It's a, a matter of are we putting the, are we investing the time? Are we making it a priority to do the things we need to do? And that really boils down to are we hearing those issues and concerns when they bring them to us? And, and if we are hearing them, how do we make sure that we know, um, that, our, that our team members know that we're hearing them, that we're taking action, that's going to take some time on our part, that's going to take some follow-up on our part, that's going to take some intentionality. And, and, and if you dig deeper into this, I share a case study of something I lived through specifically, and I watched a group of supervisors and managers not necessarily have that time. And sometimes those things went unheard, but a team of hourly shop for, or peers did give attention to that. And, and, and what I'll challenge you to consider as you work through that is think about, hey, in so many cases in society, people are hungry for leadership and, and, and being heard. And, and in many cases, that might be why young folks in cities and whatnot might gravitate towards gangs because, you know, somebody's going to lead. And if it's not us in the positions where we can have a positive influence, somebody's going to take that leadership. And we better be really, really cautious on what we're, who we're going to allow to have that leadership in, in the lives and in the, in the um, area of responsibility that we're, we're working to influence in a positive way. Now, we're going to wrap this one up by looking at the huge difference between positive leadership and negative leadership. And I'm going to challenge you to put yourself into some scenarios that you've experienced. I'll give you some examples of my own, but I'm going to challenge you to think about how you've been through similar experiences and how much different they could have been with a very, very positive and effective leader or an even worse leader and how, how that really can impact that profitability that our organizations need so much. Now, as we wrap this up, we're going to talk about how can we answer that cry for help that our team members are always asking. Hey, show me a leader. Remember, I referenced that song recently and, and, and talk about how we better be the ones to answer it and how we can take those steps specifically to work through those cries for help, if you will, and really make a positive impact. So I hope you stick with me through that. What I'll challenge you to do here is if you've never done it, or even if you have and things have changed in your role, take um, take advantage of the, the complimentary assessment tool we've built into our site. There should be a link wherever you're accessing this that walks you through what's killing your profitability. What's that biggest profitability killer? And what, what might be that top prescription to give you that quick shot in the arm to help you take or take action on it now? start capturing that profitability and and how can we help you move forward and be more effective with the team you're leading so hope that serves you well look forward to any feedback you might have make it a great day god bless